A crime scene is a puzzle that has to be solved. A whodunit, a scattering of clues to be deciphered by clever detective work and the power of science. It's very rare to find bodies in New Zealand with hands or other limbs missing. Staff remember her because she checked in, but never checked out. She never returned to that motel. We made a small incision and were able to see items of clothing and what appeared to be part of a body. There was evidence of recent fire taking place. The hands that had been cut off, stuff must have been got rid of. There was something else on the tape, wasn't there? Both pieces of tape had multiple paint fragments. There was a clear patch of dust. The cabinet that was in the garage, they matched exactly. And when we opened up, we found that there was a lot of blood spatter. What did you discover using the luminol? What was of interest was that, to me, it had the shape of an axe. The question was asked, is there any particle board at the farm? The answer to that was, yes, there is. There's lots of it. It looked like it couldn't have got in there while she was in the rubbish pit. So it really is like doing a massive jigsaw puzzle. That small little piece of board fed that single sheet. In this wrapping of her body, he's collected this piece of that particle board. Greed took over, and we believe that is the motive of why war killed Stan Lake. <laughs>